If you do test that it's the safety switch that is bad and you have clothes that need to be done ASAP and you can't wait for the part to come in, I do have a way that I'll show you to bypass the whole safety switch. Do it at your own risk, but it is a way to limp you along until the pressure switch comes in. Unplug your machine. Now we need to take off the hood and to do that, remove the two screws. You're going to want to pull out and then bring it up. Some washers have it where you have to put a putty knife underneath there. Now, press down this clip and pull up. So this is my lid switch, and you can tell when the lid comes down, it's working. But I just broke this screw housing off right here, so I'm going to order one on Amazon. Now, I've got to do laundry before the part gets here, so what you can do is you can bypass this safety switch. Now hold up, if you bypass this switch with a wire, be sure that nobody, especially kids, can get in the laundry room and open up that lid. People have gotten seriously hurt by bypassing the lid safety switch. So just make sure that it's a temporary fix and when your part comes in, you get it replaced right away. The ground is the green, so we want to jump the sides right here. This is just a piece of wire that I stripped. And just for added safety, I'm going to tape it. Okay, now we pull our hood over. I find it's best to lift up, and then it should come on over. Now for our screws. Well, I hope that wasn't too bad for you. Uh, I hope you feel empowered and confident to go into your next project and uh, do something else that you didn't think you had the skills to do. So stay tuned. I've got a lot of great videos coming up in the future to make you a little more handy.